What's up gamers? Makinochi here and welcome to episode 2, Becoming a Leader. So in this episode, I'm gonna show you how to create a guild and to be the leader of this guild and to maintain on top 3. So what you want to do here is to reach level 18 as fast as you can. On the first day or on the second day of the server, you need to reach it yeah most likely on the first day you need to reach it at level 18 so what i'm doing here is i'm sweeping all the all the stages so that i could gain experiences faster and i could also gain more experience in just in a nick of time sweep the elite stages because you have many gears and requirements that you could use for leveling up the skills of your ninjas. Now I am level 14, I can do the ninjaku training. In this ninjaku training, you could get some Icha Icha book or also you could gain some gold in this trainings. So you need to do this every day also because it is also on your daily quests or daily events and finishing the daily events is a must in every day activities that you do here so there you go i got some some gold coins here that i could use in the shop so i have already done that so as you can see now i'm by the way at level 15 and i can do level s quest training so here on level s quest training you could gain some chakras and these chakras are requirements to level up your borders or your gears of your ninjas which could increase the power the defense and all the stats of your ninjas this is also a must because this is also in the daily events or quests of your game so just do this every day don't forget to always finish this because you always need these chakras to level up your ninjas Every day you will get two attempts in this training, in level S quest training and also in ninja quest training. So now I am level 15. So always do the daily events and always get the rewards on these events and also on your quest events. Always claim those things guys. Never forget that. Because if you forget it and you won't be able to, you won't be able to claim it again on the next day. So I'm now at level 16, just two more level guys, just two more level up and I can do this already. So I'm just gonna keep on leveling up on the stages, I'm just gonna keep on training and also clearing up the stages, the lower stages if I can't clear the higher stages just to gain, just to become level 18. I'm just gonna fast forward this until I'll become level 18 guys. So just continue on clearing the stages, the elite stages, don't forget, always remember the elite stages, you always need that because you could only have 3 attempts per stage daily, unlike the normal stage where you could do it unlimited. So always remember to clear the elite stages first, clear them all, even the first one so that you will have enough requirements. To level up the gears the borders of your ninjas and if you and if your stamina is already drained uh, check always check your bag because maybe you still have ramens or chickens maybe that you forgot to use so always check them and you could use them and have some stamina again if not then just come back after some are uh, on R or half a minute or half an hour and clear the stage again don't don't wait for the next day if you are on the on a new server and you are playing already on the first day remember to drain every stamina that you have and try to reach level 18 right away because you could really have the chance here to build a good guild and also to top 
this server right away. At around here, this is the last one that I have attacked and I have reached now level 18 and guild is now open guys. So right here, I'm, so as you can see there's only two guilds yet that is being created, Devil and Google, so I'm just gonna create my guild right away. Let's just name it PH Lords. Because yeah, I have played another game and I was I also have the same guild. Unlike on my server 61, I name it Uchiha. I was trying to do it quickly. <laughs> so choose your emblem. Just choose some yeah, you have some great choices here that you have and choose maybe some unique ones that others don't usually use. It's up to you guys what you want. So I think this that one fits fits my guild well. So actually I'm on the second but with zero zero points. So what you do is always open the chest and also always beat the drum. On the first one beat right away 1000 drums. Then you you can see I'm already at top one right now. So more of the players, more of the new players will right away choose my guild because I'm on top one so just donate right away 1000 on that guild guild drums with with some 1000 drums right away to be able to become the top one right away on your server and all the top players and new players on your server will choose right away your guild which would be really good for you in the long run so I have donated 1000 now I could buy paint souls see I already now have five paint soil five paint souls then I would just keep on doing that daily because you could only beat drums once daily don't forget that and I could uh, purchase paint souls five souls per day so not bad I would just gonna have to just have to wait and just have to keep on grinding and keep on buying those souls I will just maintain now on my five on my five five main ninjas my five first ninja I don't have to rush these things up I just have to do it slowly once I will get pain then everything will go on my way that's it for today guys I hope you like this amazing video please stay up to date for the next episode Please like and comment down below for any questions and please subscribe to my channel. Merry Christmas and happy gaming guys!